Good afternoon, this is Todd Rostein of Great Falls Construction, Gore, Maine. And now, today I am at 49 Lisbon Street on the fourth floor of the new apartment that's being renovated for the Paleons. And actually just took a look at um, David Newfield of True Brick Ovens. And he's putting in an actual brick oven inside this new addition. So I just wanted to show you uh, just what we're doing on this uh, new renovation. So Dave, how are we doing over here? Oh, we're laying the uh, floor of the oven. And as you see, it's a herringbone pattern up to the mouth. Yes. Right above this section here is going to be the throat and the chimney that will go back in and splice with the existing chimney later on. So this is going to be an actual working oven? It's an actual wood-fired oven. Wood-fired oven, pizza oven. Bread, baking oven. And you can do it, obviously you can do it indoors because we're That's making right. it happen. Right. I've done a number of them in kitchens and pre-season rooms. This one's uh, custom built. Right. There are going to be details in the finish that are going to be just for this place. But you can see. Uh, what are some of these materials? What are these materials here? This is all fire brick. Yes. Which is you know sturdy until a much higher heat than will ever occur in an oven. But each of these has been cut to uh, standards that will allow me to create. Uh, rings or what's called chains of different sizes and right. eventually this will be like a brick igloo. Oh. I, uh, I noticed a certain pattern I see you've list, you've marked it out. This is sort of a herringbone pattern. Is that necessary for this type of oven? Not or, necessary but in a sense if you're going to lay a floor it might as well be decorative. Oh okay fair enough. Um, and then you can see that by the time you get to the top of the dome these bricks are oh, made yeah. so that after putting six of these together, right. you have a small keystone that goes right there yeah. and it completes the dome. All the bricks are locked together. It's an incredibly strong structure. I could get on top of the dome when it's done and stand on it. And, uh, How long will this take to put together for, for the homeowners to uh, assemble it? By Thanksgiving. Okay, so it does take about a month's time to actually assemble the whole the whole system. Right, right. The dome is part of it, and then of course the exterior um, details usually absorb about ten days. I see it's sitting on a frame in this area. So you're gonna yeah. do you cover that up with other materials? Yeah, this is what we cover with packer board and then stone tile. And I see these are all your piles of different stones that you have here, yeah, sort of the yeah. tools of the trade. Well, a lot of that was cut in my shop and brought here, but absolutely. Uh, it's the, it's the most uh, durable kind of oven you can have. I see you have, you have this little card here and just show that to everybody. And that just shows some of the different designs. But in this case, did you custom make this one for, the, uh, for this application in this house? Absolutely, yeah. So you kind of came up with some sketches and then showed the homeowners yeah. and they loved it. And yeah, we developed a CAD, a CAD design and then yeah. some pictures of different materials we would use on the exterior. Yes. Uh, we talked about the entire room, what the decor, colors, etc. And also even the style, in this particular case, contemporary Mediterranean, uh, okay. which is where we're aiming for. So the oven is going, when it's done, it's going to fit the room and fit the people's if, taste. If somebody was interested in finding out more about brick ovens, where would they go? Well, truebrickovens.com. Excellent. It's the website and truebrickovens.blogspot.com yes. is the blog. And you, you'll be led there either way. And, you'll, and where are you located? You're off. Level. Just the mountain you see in the west. Beautiful. Okay. Thank you very much, David. Thanks a lot, Todd. Appreciate it. So this is Todd Rosting, Great Falls Construction, Gore, Maine. If you're interested to learn more about projects like that, this, please give us a call at 207-839. 2744 or look us up on the web at greatfallsinc.com.